Hey guys, never ceases to amaze me the amount of disrespect for the number one asset that IT consulting companies have, which is their people. Never ceases to amaze me how their short-term thinking of some of these leaders in this industry have in respect to giving their people the best training and caring enough about them to make sure that they are they have everything they need to be totally focused on that company's mission hell most IT consulting companies they you know the people working there they don't even know what is the company's mission anyway so here's an interesting thing if you want to keep people around you need to value them and how can you value those people you need to reward them and how can you reward them well money is obviously uh, an easy target you need to value that that people that that person's ability to perform and contribute with results so if you're working on the project and if it's a one million dollar project and and if that project gives like a 40% margin healthy margin by the way you wanna you wanna give your top performers a slice of a piece of that pie you want to give them some of that money so they can feel like they're part of what you're building, what you're creating together. So if, if you're not doing that, I think you're missing a huge opportunity to make your people more involved and more able to uh, contribute to your organization's success. And sometimes it's, it's about the, the simple things. It's about caring about them. It's understanding what's keeping their minds stressed or what's keeping them to, from performing at their highest levels and once you find what that is you should go ahead and do whatever it takes to take care of it because otherwise you'll have someone who's not completely focused who's not completely committed and will end up leaving anyway because if you're not taking care of them they will try to find someone who will and it's so simple as long as you have um, a sincere interest in that person's success you will do it. So, I guess this is one of the biggest mistakes that IT consulting companies make. I'm talking about this industry because that's the industry that I know. For the past 11 years, I've seen this over and over again. This amount of disrespect, like, oh, if this guy quits, we will find another one. You know, don't, don't worry about it. Then, what you're doing once you're selling, I'm talking to these IT consulting guys, especially the guys who are selling stuff. Then what you're selling to customers is a lie. Because you're selling, hey, look at all this um, work that we've already done. Dude, the people who've done that work, they're not in the company anymore. So you're selling your past results as a promise or as a evidence, a proof of your ability to deliver. But actually, right now, you don't have any of those people. You don't have any of those resources that were able to actually pull that off. Now you're selling uh, you know promises empty promises but your customers don't 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 know this they will only find out once you actually do it and that's why that's a losing formula you will end up losing anyway so again value your number one asset people take care of them or you will lose